Hi fish people, and welcome back to my Brackish Aquarium. Um, some exciting things have happened here in the past few days as I went to the river to do a water change and got some more um, rocks, uh, moss and grass covered rocks and some barnacles and live food for them to eat. Uh, one of the things I noticed um, uh, last night after the grass was already all mowed down this you know I'm sure you see when I first put the grass in there it's uh, you know three inch grass all over those rocks uh, and then they come in and they just eat it all but if you notice off to the rock here on the side what you see in here are crown conch eggs that's how they lay their eggs so my two large crown conch, they're each the size of a golf ball. Um, there's one of them hiding back here. Um, they both decided, or one of them has decided to lay eggs uh, right on that rock. Um, I didn't know they needed a hard surface like that uh, to attach them. So I'm going to permanently leave an oyster shell like they have here um, in the tank. Um, other than that, everyone's doing really good. Um, the other day uh, when I went down, um, I think if you saw the last video, I found some clams, um, tiny clams, all about the size of a thumbnail or smaller. And I got a couple dozen of them. And uh, the other day when I went down too to get some more water and moss and uh, live food, I got some more of them. And since I put them in the tank, the water clarity is amazingly clear. I mean, it's it's this outrageous overnight how clams clean the water. Uh, I'm very surprised. Now, I've known this before by getting freshwater clams in my freshwater tanks and how clear they keep it. But, you know, these clams, they're, they're really tiny. They're, you know, smaller than your pinky nail. And, uh, wow, they, they just do a great job. Other than that, everyone in here is really happy. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to take you to the river uh, and the lagoon for a little while because they're not letting me go out of my boat and they're not letting me uh, go down there. I'll make short videos uh, down by the river when I go get uh, a water change real quick. But other than that, um, I think we're all on lockdown these days. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a video later today and I am going to show all the different species in my tank. Uh, I figured that would be interesting because there are quite a few. Um, I've got three different types of gobies, uh, a couple of blennies, all different types of snails, crabs. Uh, and, uh, you know, my new species too. I'm really excited about the Aptasia I have in here. Um, some of the uh, anemones are getting quite large and they're spreading. So I would really like to see an, uh, an anemone garden here uh, quite soon. I think that'd be, that'd be really cool. We're going to have a real undersea look. Anyways, I just thought I would bring you in and uh, show you my um, conch eggs. And uh, I'm going to do some research and see how long this actually takes. Um, they look like quite hard shells. Uh, I don't think anyone's going to eat them. So that's pretty cool. Um, you know, I'll keep you uh, informed of what's going on on that. And uh, as you can see, the hermit crabs, they just come in there like lawnmowers and eat that thick grass. They love it. All right. That's a quick video. I'm going to be back with a longer video today. Um, showing you all the different species of my fish and I'll also be giving a big shout out to my good uh, YouTube friend the tropical fish guy uh, you gotta check out his channel he has some of the most amazing bait as you will ever see and he also has another channel where he does the reviews on tripods and some camera gear and I've gotten some great advice on him on tripods and recently, recently purchased one so I'll be talking about all that later on today um, I will try and get down to the river to at least take a couple of uh, short videos because it's such a beautiful day down in the, uh, down in the lagoon. Alright, that was just a quick update. Uh, other than that, everyone doing ha is doing happy. Uh, my pipefish seems to be getting bigger and bigger. I don't think I've ever seen a possum pipefish that large. Um, Alright, I hope you enjoy this because I really do. And I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Thank you very much. Bye.